All right, welcome back, guys. Uh, we've got a little bit of a, a new setup here. I finally got Streamlabs OBS working again. Um, so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do some special league and we're gonna do first pick Rakuni. So let's see how that works. We've done a couple matches already, about four. We're currently sitting at C2. And Rakuni's a great unit, um, but I think the special league is a perfect place to test him out. So we're gonna see how it works. Basically by picking first pick Rakuni, I don't know what signals it sends, most people would expect Fran, so I almost wonder if the Rakuni pick will mess with people's brains a little bit. So we'll see. Um, the issue here is I've got the Aegir. Going into Verd is going to push him heavy into water, which I may or may not want to do. I think I'm going to go ahead and bring the Triana because I need a second healer, and that keeps me very element neutral. I don't want him to go double water into my double fire. Okay, so now he's pushing turn one. Ah, oh, okay. So I've got the single immunity, he's got immunity and CR, which is pretty nice. Um, now I've got to get a four star and a five star. Now the best four star I have currently, I think is Antares, works against most of what he's showing. But what do I bring for my, for my five star? I'm tempted to bring Josephine, because she will do a lot against all the stuns and stuff and he's packing a lot of stuns. So I said it, let's do it. Josephine's one of my best rune units as well, so I can't really go wrong bringing your best runes to the fight. And we'll see what he does. Maybe another wind? Oh, interesting. Yeah, because he's kind of out of options there. So if I ban the Ciara, I'm looking at one damage dealer. It's the Perna Show. And everything on my board, I think, works well against Perna. I've got double buff remove. Um, so I feel I feel pretty good about it. We'll give it a shot. I'm not sure why I matched with a, a Fighter 3. He must be climbing fast or something. I don't know. I really like the Antares um, speed lead, or the crit lead. It's pretty nice, especially for my Josephine, because my Josephine's crit's 51, my Aegir's crit's 58, so now they're like 50, 60, 70, like decent, respectable crit, right? So that crit lead actually works out pretty nice. Of course, not, not that I have any other options. No one else brings a leader skill here. He bans the Rakuni. I love it. He must think it is just my pride and joy, when in fact it's probably the worst room unit on my team. All right, let's go. Maybe he'll stun somebody and I'll get a turn. That's the hope. Yep, I get a turn. So I think the move is to taunt Fran so we don't get an attack buff on the Perna. Nope. This is going to hurt. This is going to be pain. The turn order of him is interesting. That he would... You'd think he would take a Perna turn, buff a Perna, and get a kill. But no, it does not. Now he gets the attack buff. What a strange turn order. I'm really, really curious about his turn order. Can we take something? We took the attack buff. That's better than nothing. Um, I think we'll wait on the AOE till he procs into his attack buff. But we need to we need to save this Triana. She needs a turn. A little bit of healing for him. We're just going to use this even though it won't brand just to cycle his turns a little bit. And then now we're safe again. Still working on the Triana. Makes sense. That's my only form of healing. We're just going to wail on this Perna till it's dead. And that's my plan. That's my only plan. I don't think I need another plan. Because Perna heals everybody else. There's my proc. So now I'm going to do the AoE. Get a little more little more bang for my buck there. I probably should have tried to stun the Orion. But Josephine is one of my best damage dealers here. And I want her to, you know, get some work in on the Orion. Or on the Perna, excuse me. Ooh, that was a nice little hit, wasn't it? Um... Yeah, let's see if we can't push the bar back on the Orion. We do not. I guess that's okay. She's going to heal? Oh, she tried to stun. I kind of hope she does stun, because then I steal a turn. There you go. That's my girl. Don't kill it. Just taunt it. There you go. All right. So now I don't think I want to kill it, um, but I will take some of this bar from the uh, Orion. Yeah. And... I, I just... I don't want to kill it yet. I need it taunted. I need it controlled, so... We'll work on something else. This may be silly and not a great idea, but if he has a cleanse, it's really a bad idea. Oh, good. So let's see if we can't get rid of that. Sleep? Nope. All right. There we go. Now he's under control for another turn. We'll see what happens here. We get stunned, which means we get a turn, right? Oh, no. We've already used our ability. Okay. Oh, here we go. We proc. All right. Now... Are we ready to kill the Perna? Not yet. <laughs> We're still not ready. We're going to make him cleanse that stun. I want to give Triana a turn, to, a chance to live here. Oh, there's the cleanse. Here comes the pain. 
Is it gonna get a kill? He does indeed. Now we're going all in on this Pern again. Maybe I waited too long. Maybe I wasted too many turns letting him power up. Don't know. Still feel pretty good here. Yep, there's the heal. Not as much as it could be. That's actually really impressive. I was pretty pretty impressed by that. There's a stun. We're gonna just keep doing damage. We still gotta get through this first life. It's taking us a while. It's a tanky, tanky Perna. Must be working well for him. Nice little revenge. Oh, here comes an Antares hit. Bam. Woohoohoo! That is some damage. That is some damage. I think this guy's got me. No question. He's wailing on me. But I'm going to keep trying because I have a chance. Josephine can do some silly, silly things. And once the Perna's down, um, I might I might have a chance. We'll see. Hit him back. There you go. I don't know how she's going to keep her health, though. We're going to have to have Aegir do stuff. There she goes. All right, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna play this out. I want to see what we can get done here. Five, ten. So it's a pretty tanky Perna. There's eight. Now it's down. I'm just gonna set it to auto on the Fran. See what it can do. Bars are pretty low, but everybody's doing damage, including the Fran. Makes sense. The Fran's got a good attack. And there, there she goes. Wow. Well done, sir. And now I know why I got matched with him. He's pretty good. So, Rakuni didn't get to play that time, but he influenced the match by being banned, I guess. Banned the Ciara. Hmm, that was that was really impressive. All right, Verd. So now I get to go Fran Rakuni. Yay. Is he going to twins me? I still don't know how to beat twins. Nope other stuff. All right, so I've got my healing in. That's water. I'm not going to get Triana. So, I guess I'm going to pretend like I got to kill that uh Verd, right? And now I get two Nat 5s. Two Nat 5s. Let's bring let's bring the Josephine again. See if we can get a little redemption. He's going to bring wind, right? Cuz I've shown heavy water. Yep. That means I can follow with Perna, I guess. I don't see, see any reason not to bring Perna. I guess the alternative would be a little crowd control. I'm tempted to bring... If I bring Ethna... Is she ruined? Nope. Never mind. So maybe I'll bring Perna and ban the Water Ninja. That seems reasonable. I'm going to get bombed all over, though, aren't I? Eh, let's try it. I'm of the opinion that if I think it, I should try it. You know, go with your gut. It's special lead, you know, learn learn things. That's my that's my theory. Like, I kind of want to get matched with twins, even though I lose a lot, because I don't I don't know that I want to play twins, but I do want to have a a counter in mind to beat twins, you know? So still working on that. That's a work in progress. Alright, we have no buff removal. That is excellent. He wants that Perna, which makes sense. I'm gonna kill his Verd anyway, or that's my plan, kill his Verd. Hmm, <laughs> what does he think I'm gonna do? I don't have any debuffs, why does he do that? The only thing I have is the ability to take his debuffs. There we are. Don't kill it. Good job. That is what we're talking about. All right, now, what do I wanna do? I think I wanna boost the Perna, and we wanna, do we want to proc the Verd right here? Or it'll proc the Triana. I guess I'm okay with that. Because she doesn't have her heal. She blew it on a nothing burger. And we get the kill here. From the stun. Not going to glance. Never going to glance, Ciara. Josephine is a weird version of Laika. I mean, you can bomb, I guess. She has a lot of health. Oh, she got another turn. She likes turns. All right. So he hasn't done his Kona yet. Oh, he quit. I was going to go for the Kona Taunt as my next thought, but... Okay, so we're one and one with the Rakuni first pick. I don't... Rakuni did one thing that match, which is one of the best things Rakuni does, so I guess that's okay. 
Burutex. Interesting. So we got to go Rakuni, because that's what we're doing. We're doing five Rakuni first pick matches. Ooh, it's going to be some sort of cleave. Ooh, Odin. Odin. All right, hold on. Let me look at this guy. So he revives. He ignores defense. All right, single target, ignore defense. So, Verd. <laughs> and now I get two five stars. How about Perna? Because Perna's great. And then we'll see what he does. He's going to bring water. Probably double water. It's kind of nice. Oh, okay. Okay. Ignore defense. That's fine. And Lucian. All right. So, I think I want to bring control here in the form of Okeanos. Because I'm going to have to deal with two of that mess. And he's pretty fast, but he has no speed leads. Maybe I should have a speed lead. What do you guys think? Let's, if we bring the Vanessa, he's just going to kill the Vanessa. Let's bring a Ciara and see how that goes. Makes him think speed lead anyway. And then i got to ban one of these things. I think the Lucian is the one I'm kind of okay with because I'm heavy on fire. Um, maybe I'll ban that, that thing. Yeah, because if I'm going to kill something... I don't know. She's pretty easy to kill, though. What's her base speed? 102, same base speed. Hmm. I think I'm okay banning her. I think I am. I don't know if that's right or not, but that's what we're going to do. All right. I get first turn. It's a good ban by him, I think. I'm probably just going to get Will. Will killed, right? Will cleaved. Hmm... Probably so. Yeah, because if they're all in will, I don't really know what I do. Kind of just chill. Oh, wow, they're not. Um, But turn order says that he's going to get a turn before I get to bomb anything. I'm pretty sure he's just going to boost, boost. And I think I had to buff, even though it buffs the uh, Odin over there. Yeah, so then he's going to buff. He's going to Lucian. Or he's going to Odin first. I guess he kills the Ciara first? Or the Fran. It doesn't really matter. I guess CR is the better kill. Yeah. And then Lucian cleans up, basically. Yup. I mean, not entirely, so I guess that's good. Um, I guess we'll go after Lucian, right? We got a little chance here. We got a little chance. We're going to buff him again. Try to cycle those turns for ourselves. It's too bad. CR must have been a pretty bad pick. I should have picked um, Wind Druid. Get one of those damage dealers that uh, doesn't die. Yeah, next time. Wind Druid. That would give me some more options. He's out of buffs for a little bit. So unless I buff, I don't have to deal with Odin for a turn or two. <clears throat> unless this guy procs a bunch, right? Ooh, that's bad. Um, What do we want here? Looking at the turn order, I'm going to cleanse him, because then Rakuni's going to cleanse Fran. And then, oh, he gets a turn. That's unfortunate. I think Fran's probably dead. No reason for him not to kill Fran, right? He goes for the AoE. Oh, I would've got a counter. Oh, and he got a stack. Oh, sadness. Sadness. We'll see what his ignore defense does on the, um, on the fire units. I think it doesn't change much, but we'll see. All right, here we go. Does he have buffs? It doesn't matter. Alright, he's going for Rakuni, I guess. Ignore defense, but not much. Does not crit. Interesting. Now I can take a lot of turns. I don't know if that's uh great for me or bad for me, but you know, can't can't hurt. I'm just gonna have to go after this guy until he dies and then comes back. With that defense buff, that makes it pretty tricky. At least he won't get to five stacks, that's something. Here comes the pain. Boom! Oh that one crit, didn't it? All right, Rakuni, it's you and him. Go get him. I tend to do this in my matches. I just set it to auto and just kind of watch what happens. It's like, I don't know, I find it interesting. I feel like I'm not wasting their time because it's auto. And sometimes I've had people try to do the thing where they let the timer go. But I'm on auto, so it's like they're only wasting their own time. All right, so now we are one and two in our three matches. Hmm. So what have we seen so far? See, we haven't seen twins yet. We might see twins. We've seen a cleave. There's a Rakuni. First pick Rakuni. All right, here's my Rakuni, by the way. He's not great. I kind of threw some runes on him for special league. Um, but it gives me another three star to use. Man, that Rakuni threw him off, didn't it? He's either thinking or not here. 
Yeah, why why wouldn't you just play your normal strategy? I don't think Rakuni uh I don't think Rakuni does too much to mess with you, does it? Alright, so we're just gonna bring the kind of support team here. And then see where we go from there. Okay, okay. Interesting. So I guess we're not bringing a fire in that five. What? Hold on. Attack me three times. Increase the defense. And it covers all allies. Covers all allies. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Okay. Um, so we got need a four star and a five star. How about you? And we're gonna I think we're banning that blue thing, right? So we're gonna we're gonna assume we're banning the blue thing. And then let's bring Perna. So then he's got to bring water. Maybe a chow? I, I assume he's going to bring water. Oh, wow, he brings fire. So then he's banning my acre? Because that's my only form of buff removal? That's my guess. Can you afford to do that? I've got lots of multi-hits. i I got to ban the water guy. Because I'm all fire. I don't really know what this guy does, but he's wind, so I'm not incredibly concerned. Yeah, he bans Aegir. Okay, which is, I mean, I don't have him in speed lead, so I guess. I guess you're my leader, Perna. This will be interesting. The one thing um, a lot of these teams have that I don't have is defense break. And his is Orion and maybe this guy. I don't know exactly what he does. We can see attack power ignores defense. Something to do with a heal, something to do with a heal. All right. Takes the 10% universal speed lead versus the 25% defense. Okay, all right. Speeds look good for me. His only speed unit is Orion. He's gonna kind of get this his alpha strike off though. Let's see here. He'll kill the Pern in one shot, right? No, going for my heal. Ba boom. Oh, okay, he does have a little uh, defense break, doesn't he? Interesting. All right, I'm gonna try to kill this wind thing because you're wind. You need to die. I'm pretty sure. Here's a nice little pop. Um, what do we want to do here? I think the Verd buff is the way to go. Because that'll give us a faster um, Perna heal. And now we're, we're feeling good. He got to do everything he wanted. We're pretty much back on top here. Try to kill this guy, and then we're going to kill um, the Gera. I mean, it's not like it's rocket science, but... You know, kill the damage dealers, right? And then the, the supports will fall. And we've got some nice little insurance here with the Triana. She's still hanging tough. Oh, another prank. Is that two and two turns? I think it might be. Pretty pretty good. I'm trying to go for the stun here on the first skill. Um, yeah, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to buff the Verd so that we can cut with the Perna heal and get a little pop from Perna. Ooh, that could be bad. Oh! Oh! Bam. Okay, that's pretty good. See the uh, the defense break? So good. So good. You know what, Fran? I'm really tempted to just pop you, but I, I'm not going to. I gotta get the Garrow. Every turn I let Garrow have a chance is bad. Did he just proc? That's three and three turns, I think. Every turn. All right, so this is gonna hopefully get Garrow, or gonna get Verd out of his defense break. Thank goodness I needed that one. Now who's his next target? Oh, he wants the verd. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do the two. Or I'm gonna do his stun. Yep, narrow escape. And will this kill? Not quite, but we're gonna kill here. That's what we're gonna do. Goodbye. Now we're solid. We just auto onto Fran. All right, so that was match four. No twins yet. We've had a lot of Fran, a lot of the normal normal stuff um ooh, is that our second orion orion's a little more prevalent than i would say is normal so we're going into match five it seems like these uh first pick whoever's always come down to two two match five hmm. weird just the way it goes maybe rakuni's just he's scaring people i don't know i'm enjoying it this the the special league uh I think the concept of first pick in Special League is kind of cool. I think we're, we're going to try to do a little more. Because it lets us showcase some weird, maybe some weirder units. I know Rakuni's not that far off the meta. But, you know, I don't feel like you'd get a, a good shake of him. Um, oh, wow. So this is going to be some sort of illusion uh, cleave, I think. 
because he's locking down first turn and he's locking down buffing up somebody to go. Um, I mean, I think if I go Fran here, I'm at least going to be immune, right? But then now it's like, well, now what do I do? Because I got to take a four star and then I need two five stars. I think I'll go Triana and just kind of punt. Because that'll give me one death prevention. If I need to, I can take a Wind Druid and have a second death prevention. Yep. There's the Lucian. All right. So this time we do want the Wind Druid. Because you can't kill him. At least not first try. Maybe Wind Druid Priana. Uh, Pri uh, Priana. Yeah, that's one of my units. Um, I'm thinking Wind Druid Perna. And that just gives me all the things that don't die. <laughs> Agar. <laughs> so Agar's not the problem here, is he? So I think... I mean, he's got two fire speed leads for whatever reason. I think if I get rid of the Lucian, I keep my Fran alive longer. I'm assuming he's going to ban... He's not going to ban the Perna, I don't think. I think I'm going to have to... Hmm. I could ban the Vanessa. Let's ban the Vanessa. Just, let's see. This may be completely crazy, but I would... I kind of want to, um... I kind of want to go first and see what happens. It might just be Fran explodes, but, you know, we'll see. I like the Wind Druid ban. That was brave. So we're going to have to power through this Lucian. Hopefully we can. If my Raccoonie was faster, I would feel much uh, more confident. Yeah, so look at the, looking at the turn orders, it's going to go Kona, Lucian, and then I think I get to go before the Barb. Oh, that was not too bad. Not too bad. Going for Fran? Or going for Triana? Oh, yeah. All right, Lucian. You've done your thing. I appreciate you, but you can... Uh, you can go away now. Interesting goes for the Raccoonie. Interesting. Do I care who goes next? I think I want Parna to go next. Get a little healing. Oh, never mind. I'll just have Raccoonie go again. And now it begins. The Great Garrow killing spree. I don't even feel like we need to heal here. He has his cleanse, right? Let's see if we can't sleep this thing. Yep. Well, that was nice. Keep whittling him down. Oh, that was nice. Oh, he's after the Parna. I mean, he, he should be. That's that's kind of what he does. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, he's not quite dead. He's not dead yet. But we are one Fran turn away. Oh, man, another sleep. Do we even... I don't even think we go after him. Let's see if we can't crit this thing. Nope. Interesting. He wants the Fran. So, do I boost the Fran? I think I do. Not for the kill, though. I don't. Well, now I gotta go for the kill. Once I proc, I put him in kill range. Oh, he didn't die! <laughs> he didn't die! I'm getting so greedy. I should be actually, like, healing my damage dealer, you know? If that's a thing people do. I'm getting too greedy. Maybe you can go to sleep this time. Nope. He didn't die, did he? He wouldn't die. Bam. Oh, he goes again. Oh, Perna's down. Oh, no. We need him. All right. Attack buff is back. We're going all in on this thing. Bring it, dude. Or maybe bring it a little bit less. Just a little bit. Hey, he's down. And that was my bad, too, because I did first skill. I should have done second skill. I was being... Uh, unintelligent. All right, I'm okay, I'm okay with this matchup. I like I like my I like my chances here. If if I get a turn, if he gets all the turns, I'm I think I'm in trouble. But we are gonna work on him because Triana's a damage dealer. She is crit. She is not messing around. Cleanse? No, no cleanse. All right, what do I want here? Mm, I think I'm gonna just boost him for a little baby heal. We will cleanse here. We're just gonna keep wailing on this dude. Cleanse? Yep. Alright, that's fine. We're not he's not cleansing out of a stun, which is what we want the least. So Yeah, see? He's missing it now, isn't he? That's what he needs there. This Triana is wailing. You're not gonna kill her. No, 
that's Fran. That's not that's not a Parna. That was a pretty good little hit though, wasn't it? Um, okay. I'm gonna boost the Fran. So that we can get a heal and immunity. Plus that speed speed boost on a 300 speed unit's pretty nice. Now then, she can just keep on healing herself. I'm okay with that. We got himself a little attack buff and another turn. He's really good at getting the other turns, isn't he? I need to get a kill here. Come on, get a kill. There's the kill. We win. All right. First pick, Raccoon. He goes three and two. We're up a little bit of points. Um, let's see how the lead's going so far. I'm not doing as many matches as I should because we're, what, days in now. And I'm 46 matches. But, you know, it's fun. I'm having fun. And the ranks are so close together that all I got to get to is 1400 for Guardian. So, in theory, I can do that over the next couple days. But, who knows? Um, we'll look at the Rakuni one more time. Because everybody likes looking at Rakuni. He is here. So, you know. I mean, that's a good rune. It's unfortunate it's got speed there, but it's pretty maxed out everywhere else. And like this is a good this is a good HP rune. Is it legendary? It's rare. Whoops, I <laughs> miscalled that one. But pretty pretty stat heavy for rare, I would say. That's another just beefy rune, and then that this is legendary. Yeah, I really like this rune. It, you know, I would have liked it more had it rolled more speed, but it's just got everything. You know, a little bit of everything. And then there's that last one. Needs a speed, but I don't think I have one. Yeah, because that's not a thing I get. Um, so there's a the stat: seventy percent resist. Pretty good HP, pretty good defense, and hey, you know, speed's okay. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. That was First Pick Raccoonie, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care, everybody.